This video is about using Photoshop Elements 10 to remove an image background uh, using the polygonal lasso tool. Uh, we have um, Photoshop Elements 10 open here, copied off the web. And uh, I'm going to take this and remove the car from the background. I'm going to do this using the polygonal lasso tool. And this one is the uh, polygonal lasso tool, so it's the one we want to select. And we're going to do this. Uh, let me zoom in on the image. So let's start with our polygonal lasso tool at a known spot. And then we're just going to work our way around curves. These are all straight line segments. So you want to, when there's a, a curve taking a place, you want to click more points along the line. Uh, the straighter sections, uh, fewer points. So a little curved objects like that are going to take a lot of points. And I'm just working. Backspace to remove any points. We have one that's uh, a little long. The underside of the car presents some particular challenges. Very difficult to see exactly where the car is ending. That's a challenging spot right here. This entire under the car. A little hard to see. And of course, it's a pretty round because of the tires, so you get quite a few points in there. And again, kind of hard to see exactly the tire there. And that brings us to the end. Now we're going to uh, go and select Refine the Edge. And make some adjustments here. This is the default values. Uh, we're going to feather that edge about 2 pixels. And smooth a bit. And we're going to expand that uh, selection edge just a little bit. And hit OK.
Now at this point, um, we're going to right click and we will layer and we hit cut. And you can see that in expanding our selection area, we've uh, actually changed um, some of the things here. And we're going to turn off this. And just to check and see how this looks, we're going to put in a uh, background layer. And that is our car. Now I have uh, turn off the background layer for a minute, and uh, also downloaded a different background. And I'm going to select the car and drop it into this other background. Well, it looks pretty good over there. You can see. Uh, this is a pretty high resolution background that we dropped it into. So we'll expand that a little bit. Move it down. Make that just a little bigger. And I'm going to rotate a little bit. Okay, we've uh, dropped this uh, into the background. Doesn't exactly look like it belongs there. Um, I'm going to uh, do a little editor of the layout style here. And we're going to do a little bit of editing of that layer style here. And um, let me do drop shadow. And we'll take a lighting angle and set it like so. I'm going to drop shadow. I can actually see that showing up on there. Okay, <clears throat> and it's uh, our car, not a perfect setting, lighting's not right, stuff like that, but uh, it's a basic idea of how to remove an image and uh, reuse that image in another uh, location. For further information, go to uh, drinfrastructure.com.